Hello. If you want to know everything about Algorand Coin, the details of Algorand Project and the price prediction of Algorand Project in 2023, then this video is for you. This is because I will be giving you full details on Algorand Coin. But before getting into the discussion, please note that this video is not a financial advice. Always do your own research before attempting to take any actions toward any of the cryptocurrencies I talk about. Also, kindly hit the like and subscribe button so it can help the YouTube algorithm push this message. Without much saying, let's get into the discussion. Algorand is a decentralized network built to solve the blockchain trilemma of achieving speed, security, and decentralization simultaneously. Algo was launched in June 2019 by a computer scientist called Silvio Micali. It is a permissionless, open source blockchain network upon which anyone can build. Algorand is designed to be a payments focused network with rapid transactions and a strong focus on achieving near instant finality which means that it processes over 1000 transactions per second and achieves transaction finality in less than 5 seconds. Algorand uses a proof of stake, POS, consensus mechanism and distributes validator rewards to all holders of its native Algo cryptocurrency. Through strong throughput capacity and equitable community incentivization, Algorand is capable of managing the high throughput requirements of widespread global usage and a variety of use cases. As a public smart contract blockchain that relies on staking, Algorand is currently capable of hosting decentralized application, dApp, development and providing scalability. Rising gas fees on Ethereum have led many dApp developers and decentralized finance, DeFi, traders to look for alternative blockchain solutions. Some have turned to Algorand as an Ethereum alternative for dApp development and DeFi applications. Algorand also allows developers to use the Algorand Standard Asset Protocol to create new tokens or to transfer existing tokens to the Algorand ecosystem. For example, stablecoins like USDT and USDC also exist as ACEs on the Algorand blockchain and enjoy much higher throughput and much lower transaction fees than what is typical on Ethereum. Further, as central banks continue to research networks to host their central bank digital currencies, Algorand has become a viable option and has been chosen to host the Marshall Islands CBDC. According to protocol structure, Algorand has a unique two-tiered blockchain structure. The base layer supports smart contracts, asset creation, and atomic swaps between assets. All of these processes take place on layer 1 of the Algorand blockchain, which helps ensure security and compatibility. On this first layer of the Algorand network, platforms and users can create ASAs that represent new or existing tokens on the Algorand blockchain. This is similar to how ERC20 tokens function on the Ethereum network. With regard to security, Simple smart contracts on the Algorand platform execute as Layer 1 Algorand smart contracts, which means they maintain the same level of security as the consensus protocol itself. The second layer of Algorand is reserved for more complex smart contracts and dApp development. It's this bifurcation of the network, between Layer 1 and Layer 2, that allows Algorand to process transactions so efficiently. With more complex smart contracts taking place off-chain, simple transactions can be processed more quickly on layer 1 without being bogged down by larger, more complex smart contracts. About the staking mechanism, Algorand uses a unique variation of proof-of-stake called pure proof-of-stake. PPOs is a highly democratized proof-of-stake consensus mechanism with a low minimum staking requirement for participating in and securing the network. Please note that only one ALGO coin is needed to participate. By contrast, Ethereum 2.0 requires a minimum stake of 32 Ether, ETH, an amount which establishes a much higher barrier to entry for users. Conversely, a low minimum staking requirement may adversely affect network security, as network participants may be less incentivized to behave optimally when they don't have substantial value staked on the network. 
On proof-of-stake networks, validator nodes are selected at random to confirm the transaction data in a block. Algorand's PPO's consensus mechanism utilizes a two-phase block production process consisting of proposing and voting. Any member of the Algorand network can participate in the proposing and voting procedure by staking ALGO and generating a valid participation key to become a participation node. Participation nodes are coordinated by another type of Algorand network node relay nodes which facilitate communication among participation nodes and do not directly participate in proposing or vote proposal phase. A block leader is selected to propose the current block. Block leaders are selected via Algorand's verifiable random function, a provably random mechanism that selects nodes randomly, but weighted by the relative size of their respective stakes. The block leader is secretly assigned by means of their private participation key, which means that only the block leader knows that they have been assigned to propose a block. The VRF supplies a cryptographic proof that allows the block leader to easily and verifiably prove their status as the current block leader. This methodology provides additional network security because malicious actors have no way of knowing who the randomly designated block leader is before the block is actually proposed. This reduces the opportunity to target the block leader in an attempt to compromise the network. According to its token, ALGO is the native Algorand cryptocurrency and it's a cornerstone of its network structure. As part of Algorand's unique protocol design, the rewards paid to validators for producing blocks are split and distributed among all ALGO coin holders, rather than being awarded only to block producers. This means that all ALGO coin holders can earn about 7.5% annual percentage yield as of February 2021. Reward distribution takes place about every 10 minutes and it is intended to encourage users to join the Algorand staking platform and accelerate the path to decentralization. To make this process even easier, users don't need to actually stake the coin themselves as part of the block production and validation process. They can simply hold Algo in a non-custodial wallet or on an exchange to access earned rewards. In this sense, Algorand has achieved near automation, as stakers can passively hold Algo while also supporting the network. Algorand has a hard supply of 10 billion Algo tokens, 3 billion Algo to be released into circulation over the first five years, 1.75 billion Algo tokens to be distributed over time as rewards for participation nodes, 2.5 billion Algo coins to be distributed over time to relay nodes, 2.5 billion of ALGO is reserved for the Algorand Foundation and Algorand Inc. And finally, 0.25 billion ALGO tokens to be distributed for end-user grants. Like many blockchain-based projects working toward an optimally equitable coin distribution process, Algorand's decentralization of its ALGO coins is an iterative process. The Algorand Foundation currently holds a large amount of ALGO, which critics claim makes the protocol centralized in the short term. However, Algorand's democratized reward distribution mechanism is built to mitigate network centralization over a longer time frame. At the moment, Algorand is trading at $0.09. Cents. With a market capitalization of around $700 million, a fully diluted market cap of around $900 million, and a 24-hour trading volume of over $20 million. With this price, I can tell you that Algorand isn't dead because you can see that it is worth something but I would advise you stay off this project if you love your money and you do not want to risk it all. Buying Algorand right now we set you up for big risk because I am sure the scandal has not been done yet. What I want for you is for you to be wise with your money and stay off this project. Please note that I'm not saying Algorand will crash but I will be a fool buying Algorand knowing fully well that this project is a scam. For now, I do not have a price prediction for Algorand. I am ready for anything that comes out of the project. Thanks for watching. We have come to an end of this video.